First, we are learning more about a gruesome murder in Johnston. Today marked the second day of testimony in Donald Greenslit's trial. Prosecutors say he killed the mother of his two children, dismembered her body, then tried to burn her remains. Today, two first responders took the stand to describe the scene they discovered. Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell joins us now with more live from the mobile newsroom. Today, jurors saw several photos of the crime scene. Some of them were so brutal that the judge didn't allow them to be seen in open court. A Johnston firefighter testifying about the gruesome scene he responded to last January. Control. What was this that was burning? This is the second day of Donald Greenslit's trial for the brutal murder of Stacy Durego. Greenslit is accused of stabbing Durego to death, cutting up her body, and trying to burn it in the fireplace in the basement of the couple's home. Today, jurors were shown several photos of the crime scene, including that fireplace. It looked like it was a mound. Didn't know what it was. It looked like blankets, maybe clothing, some kind of material and cloth all bundled up. During testimony, all three Johnston firefighters who took the stand said, Greenslit was uncooperative when they arrived on scene and even returned to the basement twice after he had been told to leave the home. The homeowner was very adamant that he did not want help. Firefighters also testified about the couple's two young children who were found suffering from smoke inhalation. As soon as I opened the door to that bedroom, uh, the children immediately jumped in my arms. With Investigators say Greenslit did confess to killing Stacey Durego, but since he was arrested, he's maintained it was all in self-defense. Live with the Mobile Newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.